Welcome back to the channel, I really hope you all have a fantastic day. Today is the best day of the week for me, Awards Day. We've got our squad battles as well as our pre-order packs. They're pretty big packs as well. We should have Elite 1? Yeah, we do. Always make sure I get Elite 1 in squad battles because 30,000 and 2 rare mega packs. Last time we got Ronaldo, look, I can play that team on the hardest difficulty and I can probably play these two teams on the hardest difficulty and then that one I would have to try. Look, there's our Ronaldo, we just packed, we packed him two weeks ago now, but... It was good. It meant we could basically get over in. Let's see what we get in these packs. The pre-order packs, which of course, well, look, bronze pack method. I'm looking, but you should definitely make us money. Three hundred thirty-three thousand. We're saving up the coins. There's nobody we really need in the team, but you know what? It was these two daddy packs that we actually packed something interesting. So I'll leave them till last. Let's do the mega packs. Well, rare gold packs. We've never really got anything yet from these yet, but hey, the pre-ordered ones. Let's see what we get. Blackboard's good. Give us a walk out. Come on. Don't think so, don't think so, don't think that's anything. Nah, but 82 rated, I can't really complain. As long as we're getting above, I don't know, what am I happy with really? I'm probably not happy with that, I'm probably wanting boards and all that, but you know what, these are okay. I will, I won't list them just yet to be honest, I'll get rid of that, I don't need that, but I'll keep everything else. I'm enjoying life though. How are you guys doing? Write in the comments. What do you get in your rewards or your squad battles, whatever you're at? Because you might get something exciting. I get something usually exciting in these. Come on, give me something. Give me something. That looks. Is that better? I can't tell. It's not been great so far. See? Rewards have not been good in terms of our pre order ones. They've just not been very good. It's any early in the morning with me. It's quite cold in this room right now, so I'm trying to heat it up with the heating right now. But hey, James Bourne and James Milner. There we go. Can I complain? Who else will we get in the pack? Come on. Nobody else of note, really. Uh, Man City badge I'll keep because I always like collecting badges. I two Premier League stadiums, but they've got shadows on them, so I'm not too bothered. Um, yeah, I keep everyone else. They might have sold because it's Emirates and all that, but here's the daddy packs. Okay, so fingers crossed. This might be a very short episode. See, if we don't pack anything after these two, I'll just show you what the team's looking like and I can talk about stuff. But come on, here we go. Here we go. Give us something. We can use, come on. We haven't had a board yet, which has been terrible. That's good, okay. Proud of this. I don't know if this is a lockout though, I can't tell. French, okay. Goalkeeper, Lloris. Oh, no. It's 84 though, right? Eh, it's better than nothing, right? Better than nothing, chat. Better than nothing. Let's see what else we get in the pack. 84. Hey, the Ronaldo way we got a while, now I've done 84, then we got Ronaldo. So let's see what we get in this. And load 83, is Ben Yedda, is he still worth something? 20k. He was a bit on 20, wasn't there? Yeah, I'm going to sell him then. But I'll sell him. I'll work out the exact price for him and I'll sell him. Uh, nobody else is worth anything in that pack, I'm sure. Uh, fitness cards. To be honest, I'll put some of the fitness cards up. And we got a gold pack. Oh, I like it. And Giroud, the icon. What a legend. What an absolute legend, chat. There we go. And we'll get rid of that, get rid of that. Everything else, I will keep, yes, keep everything else. That was actually a very good pack. I'm happy with that. Go pack first. Shouldn't get anything out of this, but you never know. You never know. You never can tell. Not sponsored by cola, but I'll drink a drink of cola. Eh. I swear Nazare was like a left mid or something, wasn't he? I can't remember. Right? I didn't even know he was still in the game. There you go. I didn't even know he was still playing professional football. That is mad as it is. He was good at Man City. I remember that. And dumb it. What a legend. He was a right back last year, I believe. Uh, fitness card, I'll keep. And uh, Strasbourg, I'll get rid of. Yeah. But that's what I can't complain. Forgetting that for a free pack. Can't complain. Here we go. Final chance to get something good. Come on, EA. Give us something. Give us something. Either way, we've had our luck so much already. Come on, come on. It's looking good. That's looking big. That's looking big. Left mid. Costa. Costa. Yeah, I like Costa. If he's worth something, we'll sell him. Absolutely. Because I'm sticking with La Liga. Sticking with the Premier League. So this guy doesn't work for a team. But you know what? If he's worth anything between... Well, he's not even worth as much as Ben Yedda, I don't think. No, he's not. You know what? For that price, I will keep him in the club, I think. Well, 84 rated. It's not like he's 85, is he? Mmm. 16k. Aye, maybe he's not that cheap. I'll keep him, though. I think I'll keep him. I'll, I'll think about selling him. I think I will. Might, might sell him. Might sell him. Might be my impact sub, funny enough. 
Uh, Italian league. I'm not too bothered about keeping. No, 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 chat. Don't worry about it. Uh, we're fine there. Keep them up. Because I don't need squad battles. I really don't. The squad fitnesses. They're not being the best rewards. I'm not going to lie. But you know what? It's better than nothing. The Rossi as well is very useful for SPCs. Position changes. Center, center, mid position changes. Love them. I love them. They're so useful. Keep everything else. I'll show you what the club's looking like. We can sell Ben Yedder and we can go put, sell Diego, whatever his name is. Uh, what is his name? Not Diego Costa. It's something Costa. I can't remember. I cannot remember his name at the moment. But I'll show you the team. This is the main team. And you'll see why none of those players really upgraded. This is the Premier League team. We didn't get any Premier League players. Of note, apart from Giroud. Of course, we got an icon. And this La Liga team. Did we get anything La Liga based? I don't think we did. We got, well, we got Ben Yedder, didn't we? And does Ben Yedder... Is Ben Yedder a lot better than... Benzema, and we can see we can maybe sell Benzema. And how much does Benzema sell for? We've gone for twenty-two. Mas it is Ben Yedder might be worth more than Benzema. Now I remember. Let's have a look what Ben Ben Yedder's card was like. Cause he's a, let's see if it's a better choice to get but Ben Yedder's card. It looks good. He's got a good stamina. In fact, I I love that. No, he's got bad stamina. I'm not interested in keeping this because of the stamina. So we're gonna sell him now. We're going to sell him now. Now, I'll just check. I can actually use my own computer to check. I want to just check to see the price. It's important to me to get it right. Eh. Foot bin. Or whatever. I think it's foot bin I use. Foot head or foot bin. They actually are pretty useful. If you have, if you do a dual monitor thing, recommend foot bin. Then. Yeah, though. You had a one to watch. I didn't realize you had a one to watch. Alright, on Xbox he's 26,000. Yeah, that's too good to pass up right now. He will never be that high again when more cards come out. So let's get him on the trade pile. If he's 26, I'll put 24. And I'll put it like that. There you go. He should sell. Uh, there you go. Douglas Costa. That was it. Douglas, eh? Costa. Because if he's worth anything between... Oh, God. He's got an icon Costa. We don't need that in our life, do we? Costa. Doug Luth, because after we get these listed, we'll go check to see what we can really upgrade in the team. Uh, 16,000, like, is that really, ch is that one of the more expensive ones, or is it better if I keep him on the team, just, uh, three star, five star. As mad as it is, I think I'm keeping him, and you'll see what I'm going to do with him in a second. Like, I'll get these listed again, no things listed again, we'll keep everyone listed. Yeah, we're fine. Keep everyone listed. We're fine. And I'll show you what I'm doing with the team. Because I'm thinking about maybe having Douglas Costa then as the impact sub. Because I have Pjanic in here. And like, Pjanic, I was just picking Pjanic because he's like, he's high rated. He's untradeable as well. I got him in a two player upgrade, Pjanic. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Like, look at the 84s we have now. It's a joke now. Uh, da -da. There we go. Just have him as an impact sub, you know? And because he's tr uh, like a first owner, he should get full chem or five chem when I put him on. But where can I upgrade, okay? Because I'm thinking, I've got the, probably the best goalkeeper for the Prem. I've got the best left mid and right mid, in my opinion, in the Prem. Centre back, you need Van Dyke, but that's too much of an investment, trust me. And there's nobody else in there. Maybe Davis and Sanchez, but that's an 83, that's reducing the rate and all that. And I like having a high rate. CB, I'm not. Could I buy Fernandinho just to put in there for now because he's an 87, and then Rodri's in the back pocket whenever he gets an upgrade, and then I can go change over? But I'm not bothered about getting fair on dealing. I actually like Rogers' card. Six foot three is pretty good. Left mid, right mid, I think I've got the best I can get. Apart from Albuquerque, left mid, who's better in the Prem? Sani, but he's worth too much. Striker, Guero is like the. Aguero or Bamiyang is like the only upgrade I can get. A striker in there, too expensive for the price. Prem, Syria. I'm not Syria, La Liga. Got the best goalkeeper here. Got one of the best, cent well, the best centre back. Probably got the best CDM. One of the best right mids apart from Messi. One, one the best cam, probably. The thing is, my strikers have got low pace. And I just had Ben Yedder there, right? So I'm a bit like, I shouldn't be wanting to upgrade my striker. Because my upgrades are either Griezmann or Ben Yedder. I don't know who the upgrade could be in striker then. Who could basically topple these two. Right back, left back, I'm happy with. I'm more interested in going like Omar's. I'm asked it was good enough. With a pace. Dude, Jordi Alba's the only upgrade on him. And he's too expensive, in my opinion, to upgrade Marcelito with that. And then Umtiti I'm happy with. 
a bit of a Rams down in time. Who's left mid in the La Liga? I really think the team's looking as best it can do. I have to wait until the team, like, more stuff comes out. Like, very interested. Let's just put our bid up to... I'll play this game all the time. I don't really... 28,000. We'll go Prem to see if anything comes up. That we're like, oh, that's really good. None of these are good enough. We've got a better left mid than Sleepy Anderson. We have Ericsson and Rodri, so it's better than that. Wan Jesus, nah. Umdidi, nah. Not interested in Umdidi, really. No. Harry Kane. Instead of what, though? Instead of Pookie? Nah. Pookie's better, I would say. Maybe, though. Maybe not, though. Maybe Harry Kane plays like a beast this year. I've, some people have told me that, funny enough. Pepe instead of... Who's our right mid right now? Raheem the Dream? Nah. Nah, Raheem the Dream's better. Um... Oh, I'm too tired to... <sighs> See, before you had a shower, you're like, still alright. But sorry, I've still got football on. I'm not bothered about telling Diego Costa or Douglas Tosta, so keep him in the moment. I'm wasting your guys' time, I do apologise. Let's just check the city in La Liga just before I go. Just before I go, and then we can call it. Because I'm interested to see if there's anything special we can... Any upgrades, you write in the comments, any upgrades I could, you think I could do. Like, all these guys aren't any upgrades to me. Semedo is probably an upgrade on... Marcelito, but he's he's, such, he's 90k, and I could sell Marcelito for whatever the 30k he goes for, and then I'll pay 60k for him on top of that. Mm, I don't know, I don't know about that. Then that's also giving me an inform in the club, but you know what? Nah, getting that Dembele, I didn't realize how good of a deal that was in terms of getting an untradeable Dembele in the pack pool. That's like a 70 to 60k player, which I didn't realize at the time. Excellent. But drop a like, drop a comment, drop a subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. It is my favourite time of the week. We didn't actually get any big players. We only got an 84 was the highest rated, but that's a bit of a shame to me. But we had like two 30 packs that were all rare. Two 12 packs that were all rare. Like, come on. We had over 50 player, 50 items that were rare in that pack open and not one of them was walkout. What can you do? See you in the next one. Peace.